Over the past six months, the Lake Havasu City Police Department's Special Investigations Bureau has been conducting an investigation into several subjects selling cocaine and other drugs around the city. As a result of the investigation, search warrants were served on October 26th between 12.30 and 3 a.m. at four locations in the city. The locations included the 1600 block of South Palo Verde Boulevard, the 2200 block of Interceptor Drive, the 3100 block of North McCulloch Boulevard, and the 3200 block of Star Drive. Assisting during the service of the search warrants was the Lake Havasu City Police Department SWAT team, the Bullhead City Police Department SWAT team, the Drug Enforcement Administration, and the Arizona Department of Public Safety Gang and Immigration Intelligence Team Task Force. Seized during the search warrants was approximately 2.5 ounces of cocaine, two pounds of marijuana, a pound of marijuana extract, 150 Xanax pills, a usable amount of cybocillin mushrooms, ecstasy pills, four AR-15 style rifles, six handguns, a 12-gauge shotgun, several hundred rounds of ammunition, 130 high-capacity rifle magazines, over $1,000 in counterfeit currency, three vehicles, and over $30,000 in U.S. currency. Arrested during these search warrants were 21-year-old Brandon Cruz, 23-year-old Jordan Cadiz, 18-year-old Caitlin Kennedy, and 21-year-old Nicholas Kaminsky. Brandon Cruz was charged with transportation for sale of narcotic drugs, possession of narcotic drugs for sale, possession of dangerous drugs for sale, conspiracy to sell dangerous drugs, possession of drug paraphernalia, and misconduct involving weapons, all felonies. Jordan Cadiz was charged with conspiracy to sell narcotic drugs, transportation of narcotic drugs for sale, and possession of drug paraphernalia, all felonies. Caitlin Kennedy was charged with possession of dangerous drugs for sale, possession of narcotic drugs, possession of marijuana, and possession of drug paraphernalia, all felonies. Nicholas Kaminsky, charged with possession of marijuana and possession of drug paraphernalia, both misdemeanors. On October 28th, 20-year-old Joseph Goding was arrested without incident as a result of a follow-up to this investigation. Joseph Goding was charged with possession of narcotic drugs for sale, possession of dangerous drugs for sale, transportation for sale of narcotic drugs, possession of marijuana, and possession of drug paraphernalia, felonies. On October 31st, 22-year-old Daniel Gary was arrested without incident as a result of follow-up to the investigation. Daniel Gary was charged with transportation for sale of narcotic drugs and conspiracy to sell narcotic drugs, both felonies. During the service of the search warrant in the 1600 block of South Palo Verde Boulevard, 21-year-old Charlie Gonzalez produced a handgun and was involved in a shooting with two of the Lake Havasu City Police Department SWAT officers. Gonzalez remains hospitalized in critical but stable condition at a Las Vegas, Nevada area hospital. Details of Gonzalez's involvement is still part of the investigation being conducted by the Kingman Police Department. Jim Matthews, Havasu Video News.